Good morning, Ricky. Good morning, everyone. Here's your Thursday morning headlines. As emergency crews scramble to help those still trapped in their homes, more than 2.5 million residences and businesses are in Florida are without power. FEMA officials recommend steps to stay safe, disconnect electric appl- appliances to avoid any harm or damage from power surges, keep freezers and refrigerators closed to help maintain cooler temperatures for food preservation, and turn off the main power breaker in your house. Do not use Use any devices that are wet. More ways to save to stay safe can be found at FEMA.gov. The extremely dangerous conditions that Ian is unleashing, including catastrophic floods and life-threatening storm surge, will continue as the storm moves across the state and north towards Georgia and South Carolina. In other news, the U.S. Embassy in Moscow has urged that U.S. residents leave. Russia immediately. The alert follows U.S. government warnings to Americans to avoid traveling to Russia or leave if they're there now. The repeated warnings followed turmoil in Russia after the president there announced a mobilization of Russian civilians to fight in Ukraine. Lastly, Ricky, the stock market recovered a bit yesterday from its long slide. The S&P 500 index, the Dow Jones average, and the Nasdaq all rose about 2% in a broad-based rally. Of course, you can read more on these stories and other headlines at rickysmileymorningshow.com. 